Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I'm here with Dr. Stone season 2 episode number 11 and this is the final episode of season 2. <clears throat> Alright, uh, the previous episode, uh, something extremely uh, shocking happened which I had like no clue that like I, I, I did not even expect something like this happening like the show going to this direction so suddenly like they like they just had uh one of the best things happen to them like they were uh, like you know they uh, got back mirai uh sukasa was the, like you know like got to meet uh, his sister after so long and his sister is fine now after like she woke up from the coma and then something like this happens the whole like yoga thing and <clears throat> them fighting and yoga kind of uh almost killing sukasa and then Senku and Sukasa versus Yoga that uh, like the whole fight happened and I really don't want Sukasa to die you know because uh, one of the most like biggest reason for that is like he and Senku just became friends you know like they just became uh, like was starting to be able to look at the same direction they started to have the same goal but like I don't know like I like <clears throat> like I kind of understand like they're trying to uh, you know reduce uh, the Senku team's power because Sukasa and Senku the strongest uh, primate and the smartest person like they'll be unstoppable so I think that was the reason why they kind of uh, like like took this uh, direction the anime took this direction <clears throat> but at least don't kill him you know like do something else but please do not kill him but i don't know what's going to happen who is even going to help them now and in this stone world uh like you know like death is something that kind of happens quicker than in the modern world because there's no medical things so let's wait and watch and i'm guessing we're going to get some conclusion in this episode so yeah anyways uh, without further ado guys let's get started with uh, the final episode of this season episode number 11 of Dr. Stone season 2. So I'll be putting the subtitles and the timer here sync it to whichever is your preference and let's get started. Okay so here's the countdown. 3, 2, 1, go. Oh my god Omra is here. <clears throat> oh great. Oh, thank God, she's here. Oh, thank God. Quick, quick, yeah, yeah, like... Kasa. <clears throat> oh, yeah. What about Sukasa? Come on. Um, Sukasa. <laughs> Damn, wow. Yeah, exactly. Okay, I'm guessing Sukasa will be fine. Like, I was a little bit worried, you know? Mm, yeah. <clears throat> yes. Yeah, it's the start. <laughs> Yep. Okay. Um so it's not fatal, is it? Uh the wound. I'm thankful for that, you know, because I was kind of worried. Because nowadays you cannot, you know, like <laughs> like anything can happen in anime. Like there's no <laughs> Like, you know, security for the characters. Like, anyone can end up dying in any episode. It's, it's like that nowadays. 
so it's a little bit of concerning you know especially if the character is not a main character like main characters have this kind of a plot armor but like the other characters they're in constant danger Okay, so everyone is friends now, that means, isn't it? Except a few of them, for example, Homura and Yoga. Yeah, those two are the only... and Yo, Yo is there. I'm not sure what Yo will do now. Like, will he... Let's see. Prologue of... <laughs> what? This is a prologue? <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Yeah, what's those muscles for? Yeah, like use those muscles. <laughs> Glasses will save you. Oh yeah, she's... Damn, who is this old man? Yeah. Okay, let's see. Yeah. Yeah, he'll die. Oh my god. That's pretty scary. Okay. Oh, ho, ho. what the hell? <laughs> yeah. Oh, he's a mangaka. Is this the mangaka of Dr. Stone? <laughs> Who knows? Oh boy. Hmm, yeah. <laughs> What's with Gen's face? Ah, Yo is there. <laughs> yeah, here he is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Hmm, yeah. <laughs> Statue plus puzzles. No. <laughs> ah. Yeah, how do you even put them together if just uh, like all. Yeah, like all are the same place. Like, you know, you can mix up someone else's body with someone else. What's his? Wait, his? Oh, is it telling him where? Okay, okay, like where? Where the broken pieces are? Damn. Well, yeah, you know, like it's taking a life.
Ah, ok. Not anyone from the village. Yeah, like... Will he be able to make some kind of... Chloroacetate. Sodium chloroacetate. Side and middle. Yes, cyanoacetate. <laughs> Ethyl cyan. Oh man. Super blue. Oh, okay, okay. It'll only like kind of stop. Yeah, stop the wound. Like, I th I'm thinking, like, is there a doctor somewhere within the... Like, someone within the... Petrified people? Like, any doctor? <laughs> They're eating ramen? Impossible. Hmm. <clears throat> it's most patient, yeah. Just one way, okay. How? Oh. I was thinking, but how are they going to do it? Like, they can petrify him and then unpetrify him. But if you don't know how to petrify someone, how are you even going to pull it off? If we don't know the secret of petrification. Oh, her dialect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, no anesthetic. Ah. Uh... <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, but Okay, let's see. Okay. Oh my god. Yeah, but how would Yeah, you can do that, but how are you going to petrify him in the first place? Oh yeah, okay, so he's buying time for the... Oh. 
what oh cryogenic oh yeah cryogenic sleep okay yeah that is also another way okay he can do that like cryogenic sleep is possible most probably It's a temporary death. <laughs> you forgot about that? <laughs> what? Wow. Okay, that is possible, I think. Cryogenetic sleep. Because Senku is a scientist, he can most probably do it. Wow. <laughs> we are the yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but for humans. It's possible, you know. Too <laughs> good. <laughs> okay. He transfer away. Oh, okay. Well, that's easy. No, I think, yeah, like, it's more complicated, but these are, like... Yeah, that's true. Oh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> New science. Mm. Yeah. Please try her. <laughs> okay, there you go. <laughs> yeah, so Kasa will get in. Hmm. Hmm. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. All right. Yes. Mm. Hmm. 
<laughs> oh. Okay. <laughs> wow. Oh. Yeah. Oh, wow. Mm, yeah, first, I think second or third episode. Or was it the first episode? Hmm. Mm, the first house. Thank you, quick. <laughs> yeah. Wow. I don't think it was an attack. I I think it was something Yeah. Hmm. Oh. What? Made some transportation or something? Whoa. Yeah. But we have a, a tank, you know? We have the wheel. <laughs> no, obviously not. Yeah. Ship. Oh, damn. Okay. <laughs> uh. 
All right, let's do Age of Discovery. <laughs> Look at you. <laughs> yeah. Okay, this will be interesting. Okay. What the? Who is this? To be continued, so a new uh, season will come. Who is this person? He's like, what, what's he doing? Like, what? What is this? Okay. <laughs> um. All right, so that was the end. Oh, and it, it said that to be continued. So that means uh, we'll get a new season later on, like eventually. So yeah, like I'll definitely continue this uh, when it comes out. So okay, so this episode, um, <laughs> like I was not expecting this. Like they went to like uh, towards the whole cryogenic route where they are going to freeze him up. Now I'm really not sure how it actually what actually happens. Most probably, I think like as far as as I know, like uh, cryogenic sleep sleep is like uh, when your body like you know like all the uh, actions that are happening in your body are like extremely reduced because of the you know cold. I think like it's like uh, like a one out of thousand times uh like reduced or something like that i'm not sure but maybe it's something like that when your body is freezed at an extremely cold temperature it starts like every like uh, action that's happened happens in your body for example your blood pumping or like anything your respiration and uh like the metabolism that's happening in your body everything reduces to an extreme minuscule amount I think that's the theory behind the cryogenic sleep. I'm not actually sure. Like it's it's just something that I think I'll have to, I'll check it out later on. So like thinking about it like that, it is possible, you know, to like 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 put someone into cold sleep for uh, like a few years, and uh, like and he or she won't even need any kind of food. Or anything like any sustenance because they're the things that are happening in our body are like extremely reduced so like that's the reason I think so like Senku did this so obviously like he's a scientist he knows all of the theory and everything like how it works so I think it's possible to do it uh, just like that you know and obviously like they're saying it's a refrigerator but I doubt the like you know the coldness is like a refrigerator it's many more times colder than a refrigerator like they were just saying that yeah it's like a refrigerator but i think the cold uh, like the temperature is extremely low so like they like freeze sukasa and uh, so like their plan is like they are going to freeze Tsukasa. like uh, the first thing that they do did is like stitch up sukasa so that the blood does not you know flow and it kind of reduced the blood loss and then they uh, like freezed him which will uh, reduce the metabolism and each and everything of Sukasa's body it will reduce it and uh, like they put him into cold sleep and they're going to look for the petrification uh, like a reason of petrification what actually happened and if like they can also learn this thing like this how to petrify people so after they learn about the petrification, they're probably going to come back, unfreeze Sukasa, and then again petrify him, and then unpetrify him. So that's what's going to happen. But I don't know. I think like, you know, like uh, the better way would have been 
uh, to like for Senku, like uh, like the thing that Senku did here, like he like frees Sukasa, that should be done. Like he should do that. Like that's okay. But after that, like he is like going to find something that he doesn't even know if he himself will be able to uh, do later on. Like this whole petrification thing is something that is quite like outside the bound of science. Like bounds of science. So like even after Senku gets to know like uh, how the petrification happened, will he be able to replicate that? That's a big question. So instead of going like you know like uh, in a, on a wild goose chase, like he could have just you know like unpetrified some doctors, made some new uh, you know like hospital or stuff like that like medical equipments and stuff, and unfreeze Sukasa, then like uh, you know. Uh, like did some treatment but I think there is a big problem if he went towards this route so that's why I think he went towards the other route that is finding the petrification the problem that would have happened here is like as Senku said and Sukasa himself also I think said that I'm going to die like no one can save me like it's it has become something like like you know like the, the time has wasted so much that like I'm probably going to die so maybe even if he like did all of these things like unpetrified a doctor made some hospital stuff like medical equipments and everything and then un, uh, like uh, unfreeze Sukasa and you know like the doctor would have come and operated on him like uh, keep him uh, under medical care even if he did all of these things for Sukasa most probably the medical uh, like you know the medical help won't be able to uh, cure Sukasa and he would have died eventually most probably that is what have happened uh, what would have happened if he went like you know in this path so that's why he thought that okay like i won't take any risks the only thing that we can do like in this situation to keep uh, uh scars alive is freeze him and we go and look for the petrification like method <clears throat> And the petrification method is like a revival, uh, like, you know, revival technique. Like, if someone is almost dying and if he, like, you know, uh, like, is almost dead, you can petrify him and then not petrify him, he'll be like a new man. Like, that's the petrification. So, that's why, like, uh, going in this path, like, going in the petrification path, kind of makes, like, uh, Sukasa's survival chances 100%. Like if if they're able to find the method of petrification, like they'll be able to uh, like petrify him, and when he un uh, gets unpetrified, like everything will be like healed, and he will be just fit, and there'll be no problem. So that's the I think that is the reason why like he said that okay let's go and find a petrification method, which he himself doesn't even know if he will be able to get or not, or like will he be even able to like replicate the whole petrification process so yeah but yeah and yeah that's it and uh like as i was saying like they kind of did what i was saying like i was saying like don't kill off sukasa just kind like keep him like if you really are like uh, like, like obviously they're concerned about the strength like if sukasa is alive like their strength will be immense and uh, like Kasa and Senku they'll be like the strongest team and like no one will be able to threaten them so that's why like I was thinking like uh, like don't kill him off just make some kind of situation where he won't be able to help Senku but he's at least alive and yeah that's what they did so like they kind of like like he's freezed now obviously he cannot help and yeah but he has all of the other you know other members other friends and i think like most of the like they are like going to okay like let's talk one by one uh i'm kind of like jumping around the uh, okay so yeah uh first uh we see like uh like first uh homura was trying to uh mess like you know like kind of finish the whole uh like finish sukasa but thankfully the uh, senku's friends came in time and and then uh <clears throat> yeah then they go like at that moment i thought maybe sukasa will be fine you know like they were kind of nonchalantly kind of like doing everything i was thinking oh maybe his like wound is not so uh like serious turns out it's not so yeah like that's a shame 
and then uh like we go back to the like uh village and like they're unpetrifying people and it turns out like as like senku kind of said that if like broken parts are like assembled and unpetrified like the person will be like a new man like nothing will happen they will not die so that kind of proves the whole uh you know like authenticity of the um, petrification and unpetrification method so like it's like a uh, kind of like uh what can i say like uh method for someone to like like it's like like everyone will be uh, unpetrified and they'll be all like fit they'll be all fine any type of disease they would would have had in their uh, like you know in the uh, previously it will all be gone like if someone has some kind of terminal disease it will be like healed like it's like an amazing thing you know like everyone who will be unpetrified will be like a new man or a woman new woman so like i think like you know like we should keep an uh, attention to this like everyone is saying like uh a kind of saying that yeah the person who petrified must have done this because of like some bad intention or something but maybe not like who knows like who even petrified and why did he even petrify he or she so yeah and then uh, like yo comes back and they are like uh, doing their own job like like arranging things and everything and uh like the journalist lady uh so like i like he kind of mentioned it in the previous episode and i kind of forgot so her task is like she knows like who is uh, like who is where and everything so, like she keeps a tab on everything so that's how like he like she's like the information person like from her like they'll get all the information and they'll be able to you know like uh assemble the um what do you call them the stone parts <clears throat> and then like uh they meet uh yoga for a little bit yoga and homura they're like uh, in, uh like behind bars and uh then like senku comes up with the idea of petrifying tsukasa and i was thinking like how are they even going to petrify them so like they're going to you know like cryogenic freeze him and then uh, like find the method of unpetrification and petrification yeah and uh like they made a kind of like a refrigerator and uh obviously i think the coldness of that thing is a lot more than refrigerator because like like who even freezes in refrigerator temperature you know <laughs> like no one freezes like that's extremely high temperature uh, uh, it's like to freeze someone like a human being it needs to be extremely cold so i think like they're just saying that it's a refrigerator but it's actually not it's something even more colder like extremely colder uh like by you know like immense amount yeah and then uh like sukasa and um senku uh they have a little bit of a conversation conversation which is just like you know friends talking uh like no serious stuff and uh, like yeah it's kind of sad like they were like the first people in this stone world who were like unpetrified and sukasa is like in this condition now so yeah and then <clears throat> like sukasa is freezed and uh, i'm guessing like uh, the other people that is like the villagers and everything they are like kept beside you know like uh, given the responsibility of look, keeping an eye on like that refrigerator and sukasa so that nothing nothing bad happens and like the villagers will be back in the villages and senku and the main characters uh, who are like i'm guessing senku kohaku um, and like who else like usually ha taiju uh, gen ukyo uh, nikki yo Kinro, uh, Ginro, and like all of them, like Suika, is, is Suika here? I think so. Yeah, Suika is here. So like Magma. Oh, and uh, what was his name? I forgot. I always forget his name. Uh, like Kohaku's dad. Oh, great. Uh, Kohaku's dad. What? Uh, I always forget his name, but he's also here. I was thinking like he was going to be back at the village, but turns out that he's also with them. 
so okay and uh, yeah the whole crew like the main main characters they're all like uh, like going to make a ship like they kind of like they kind of like uh, <laughs> in the end they kind of showed it as if like uh, all of them are like uh, the ship has already been made and they are like off, out on a journey but actually no that's not the case they're just like that that's just like uh what can you say like uh like thing that they showed us but actually they have to make the ship first you know like 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 by the way it ended like i was kind of thinking that okay like in the next episode like in the next season when they start we'll be pr like probably on a ship and going like out sailing but no that won't be it they like in the next first episode of season three uh, which will eventually come i'm sure like <laughs> We're going to see like them like building the ship, which would probably take one or two episodes, and then they're going to you know go off. Now this also kind of uh, uh, you know like <clears throat> this also uh, like poses a question that is the like people we saw on the ship are all of them going to go with Senku or a few of them will be back in the village? You know like because this was not the crew like I, I was i was kind of like confused like no this is not the crew that uh, they're going with it's kind of like a like thing they showed just for this like you know how dr stone does like they kind of like shows us in uh like uh the characters in this kind of fantastical situation so it was just that so like the crew members won't probably won't be like this you know because i was thinking like each and every main character is w with senku so who is even going to be in the village you know like who is going to protect them so maybe like they're going to switch some people here and there and some of them will be in the village and like us like some of them will go with together with senku most probably the main characters will obviously be there like senku chrome um gen will also be there most probably kohaku would also be there i think and who else who else are the main characters uh, I'm not sure if Ukyo, Nikki, and they'll also go with Senku or not. I don't know, man. Maybe one of them will go, or like all of them will go. I'm not sure. But yeah, like the main main characters, they'll probably go. And uh, but I don't, I I don't know. Maybe all of them will go. Who knows? Like I'm just guessing at this point. But yeah, like like in the end, the thing that we saw that was just like a situation that they kind of showed us. Like you know, like like all of the characters wearing pirate clothes and everything. Uh, like just like a fun little segment so that was not actually what's going to happen i think so so yeah we're probably going to in the next season we're probably going to see like them making the ship and then like then them setting off on the journey uh yeah so that was it guys uh this was the ending episode of season uh what is this season two of dr stone now i don't know i i don't think they announced a third season did they but the way they kind of uh showed us like that uh, uh, to be continued that i'm sure like that uh implies that we'll have a new season yeah but okay like there's no uh like uh no announcement i think no i don't think oh wait a minute Oh no no no! There there is a uh, there is an announcement. Okay, here it is. Like Doctor Stone anime series sequel introduction. Uh yeah 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 yeah. We have an announcement. Yeah, we have an announcement. Okay, we will get it. Like it's confirmed. So like they made the announcement. That means like we're sh like sure to get it soon, aren't we? I I guess so. So yeah like we'll get it soon soon enough like i think like you know so yeah that is it so thank you guys for watching this was episode number 11 there is a final episode of dr stone season 2 so thank you guys for watching and if you guys enjoyed my reaction press the like button subscribe if you're new to the channel or you have uh, if you haven't subscribed or you are new to what the hell am i even saying okay let's start it again thank you guys for watching if you guys enjoyed my reaction press the like button subscribe if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed consider doing so and comment down below anything you want to say or anything you want to share i'll be sure to check them out so yeah guys and uh like this is the end of dr stone uh i'll be waiting for season three and i'll be waiting uh like i'm sure we'll get a uh, like proper you know proper announcement with a date like a proper date uh, soon enough uh 
uh, I'm just guessing maybe like uh, you know almost at the end of this year we'll probably get uh, the third season or maybe in the next year like you know beginning of the next year uh, in, in that uh, like you know in that time frame we're probably going to get the next season it's just a guess so yeah so like i'll definitely be waiting for it and when it starts you know airing i'll definitely react to that so thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys in the next video so until then goodbye and have a nice day